and they're gonna have to come up with as many examples as possible of the world's worst dating service video. The world's worst dating service video. Happy birthday, now blow me out. I'm Eric Estrada. I promise not to do it too fast. You might get the bends. Yeah. Uh, I like a man who's a tiger. What kind of animal are you? A tiger? Hey, that would be interesting. Say I was in a cage with hams all around me and 15 hungry tigers. And they start moving closer towards me. I can see the... They, were, they want to eat me up. They want to rip me apart. <laughs> That's one number two. And uh, we have to come up with as many examples as we can of the world's worst what, Wayne? You're going to be the world's worst television program. We're now round three of championship dominoes. <laughs> What's going to happen today on Things Your Cat Can't Swallow? <laughs> Celebrity phlegm. <laughs> if you were a new Spice Girl, what would your name be? A new Spice Girl. <laughs> I'd love to be a Spice Girl. You know, they, they wear all those tight clothes and they jiggle. Meh, 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 meh. <laughs> Just the way they move across the floor with. All right. <laughs> Bachelor number two, what would a romantic evening with you begin with? Well, we quickly disrobe <laughs> and start... <laughs> Do me a favor and make that cheap sound again. <laughs> Colin is an entire zoo. No, <laughs> no. Whenever he gets what, he does what? Oh, whenever he gets horny, he turns into an animal? <laughs> yeah. Cops. Cop shows. Cop shows. So, everybody, let's hear the cop show hoedown. I saw a cop show. It really made me mad. It was so horrible, the writing, it was sad. More I watched it, the more it was the pits it had. A pagoda and Eric Estrada was called Fish and Chips. <laughs> yeah. 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 Children, let's do the children hoedown with double or hall, or hall. Take it away. My wife always bugged me to start a family, but I had a real low sperm count, so it was hard, you see. So we did something that I think was really bold. We adopted triplets. They're girls and 18 years old. Ryan and Colin are two high-strung poodle owners. <laughs> Competing against each other in a national dog show. Start out normal, and I'll bring you in with the other styles in a minute. You keep that poodle away from me. Excuse me, my poodle is was grand champion. 
Well, now it's time for Fluffy to take the crown. Oh, really? Ching Ching Chong. <laughs> Put the puppy on the floor, let him go. <laughs> No, don't eat the puppy, no. no. Puppets. Your dog can hardly walk at all. I'm telling you. <laughs> Romper room. And that's how we move in different directions. Well, it's time to see who's out there to judge our dogs. <laughs> oh. oh, those are a lot of judges. Well, judges are good. <laughs> uh, uh, sports replay. <laughs> Let's see that again. <laughs> You don't like. Oh, good, good one. That's a good one. Let's do the family reunion hoedown. Take it away, Laura. Hey, family reunion, about which I'm about to sing. Strange things are always happening. I went to see my favorite uncle, but he was not there. He had an operation. Now he is my Aunt Claire. <laughs> Bachelor number two, hello. Howdy! Bachelor number two? Yeah. If I were gonna bake... <laughs> what would your cookie look like, Bachelor number two? What would it look like? It wouldn't look like my mother! <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on here. What is this? A, an audience or an oil painting? You better watch it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on, I've seen younger faces on money. Money. Okay. <laughs> faces on money. You sound creepy. Bachelor number three. Bachelor number two. If you, if you were to start your own cable channel, yeah. what would it be about? Oh, I just. Oh, you think this is easy? You think it's easy? You think this is easy? <laughs> Come on, you be funny. Go on. Yeah, I don't care. Yeah, you go ahead. Colin Mockery, Colin. Thank you. Sorry, I was at the Dinosaur Institute today and... Uh, <laughs> Movie usher hoedown. I went to a movie the other day. I put down all my money. I got in a fight with the usher. It wasn't funny. I hit him really hard. He wished he never wasn't born. And to get his revenge, he peed in my popcorn. Oh, it's my turn, is it? Yes. Thanks. What? Thanks for taking the top stories. I'm stuck with the dog story. The dog story is... Shut up! <laughs> oh, shut up. Just do it. Do it. Well, uh... Oh, so he doesn't. Th thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Colin. Those are certainly things we'll think about as the newscast goes on. Well, we look forward to hearing from you again in 5 to 10. <laughs> Colin, don't you think that'd be more appropriate after Colin, we... Colin, don't you think it'd be more appropriate after we... <laughs> 
the shoplifting hoedown. Laura Hall, whenever you're ready. The other day I stole something, it really was a sin. It was a little revolver made of gelatin. It really was a bad idea, something I should have slept on, because I was arrested for carrying a congealed weapon. <laughs> Uh, the wrong thing to say, and she says, I love you. Yeah, keep the change. <laughs> I love when personal experience seeps into you. <laughs> if dogs could talk. My wife just doesn't understand you. <laughs> Greg and Wayne, you're going to be sportscasters commentating on an everyday event. And Ryan and Colin will act out the event in slow motion. <laughs> Ryan and Colin, you are two plumbers making a house call. Two plumbers making a house call. It's incredible. What is happening right now is, a, uh, is Morton is pulling out a big socket wrench and he's pumping the pipe. He is pumping the pipe. He's loosening the pipe. Pumping it is. But it looks like Ryan's got something in his sleeve there. I can't quite oh. make it out from here. Can you see what oh, that is? Oh, it's the plunger! Oh, it's the plunger! Look, look! I don't care who you are. Ooh. That has got to hurt a I, lot, huh? Morton's got something in his head. Oh, it, it is the old clamp nipple twist. <laughs> this is horrible, horrible! You know what? That was so gruesome. Let's see it again in the miracle of super slow motion. See, see. As we reverse back, there comes Morton with the nipple clamp. What's going on there, Juan? As you can see, he uses all of his torque to grab the areola. He's twisting it, he's twisting it, and there, that is how you win. That I would not want to be in his shirt. Well, the action continues here as they go for the final plunge. The good thing, the good thing is his defense is he has no hair. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> there goes Morton. Oh! It's the trouser drop. Oh! How long <laughs> Surgery! We're doing surgery. Here it comes. That's what I heard first. We're going to do surgery. Surgery. So, uh, Laura Hall, whenever you're ready, let's do the surgery hoedown. <laughs> Throughout my life, I used to laugh like this. He, he, he. Not so since I've had some major surgery. It really went horrible. It realized all my fears. Because of that surgery, I now pee out my ears. <laughs> And now, with the local report, here's Chester Buttocks. Forgive me, it's... I haven't had my last confessional since... Uh, never. Uh, I've been uh, very bad. I shave... animals... for my own entertainment. And then I make them do high-stepping Broadway musicals. <laughs> oh, what, what is my penance? Well, that's from the Too Much Information desk. <laughs> I, I just thought of another one. I have impure thoughts about the Teletubbies. <laughs> For some reason, I feel like I need to take a bath. <laughs> but first, an international report from Bill. Bill Rutherford, Bill. Who's the widow newsman? Who's the widow newsman? Oh, is that smelly? Is that smelly? He go poo woo woo woo. He go poo woo 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 woo. Oh, that's a nasty thing. Oh, that's a nasty thing. I want to put it. I want to put it, put it, put it. I want to put it, put it, put it. Keep us up to date on that, Bill. <laughs> now, people who shouldn't rap. Oh, boy. <laughs> Avalanche. There you go, an avalanche. That's good. Uh, it's about a avalanche and wrap away. Whenever you're ready. Hi there, guys. Hi there, dogs. I saw you while I was standing on the log. I saw the avalanche come down the pass. That's why I brought this magnifying glass. We we'll use the sun and the heat rays to make everything way, 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 way safer. 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 They are now. 
will be flood. Uh, tsunami. Let's make it a tsunami. <laughs> okay, uh, so you're gonna rap. The scene is about a tsunami, and uh, so go ahead whenever you're ready. I even had time to shave. I know it's dangerous, it's quite debatable. Come with me, my pants are inflatable. I'll blow them up, to ride the wave. I'm not all of you, I will save. Uh, so, Laura Hall, whenever you're ready, let's hear the television hoedown. The other day, I went out and got a new TV. Just the thought of watching it filled me up with glee. But when I turned it on, you know, boy, I really lost it. Because the only thing it picked up was Veronica's closet. Yeah, I see some ID. <laughs> Don't I look old enough to drink? Don't you know the drinking age is 47 here? <laughs> Does it matter that I'm Canadian? You're Canadian? Can't you tell? Have you ever heard of a town called Moose Jaw, Saskatchewan? Isn't that right beside left noob? <laughs> Still here. <laughs> Is it all right if I have a parrot? What's his name? Why do you ask? Are you aware that he just went on your shoulder? <laughs> Don't you know that's good luck? Oh, is it? Don't you read books? Do you want to dance? Yeah. Come in, come in. Hello? Our top story from the Middle East, Benjamin Netanyahu today changed his name to Benjamin Netanyahu! <laughs> <laughs> and on a different note, terrible bus accident today. Blanched? Today there was an accident. A busload of penguins. <laughs> penguins! They don't do any harm to anyone! And they only have sex once a year! <laughs> oh, the inhumanity! <laughs> What's that? Get a grip, all right? Okay. Colin? Everywhere, chaos! Burning fire! No! No! Oh, IRS, that's okay. The Internal Revenue Service, who I love. Uh, they might be annoyed at it, but it's not me. I love the IRS. Let's hear the IRS hoedown. I live in Canada. There is no IRS. I still have to pay taxes, but I'm not that distressed. I owe 18000 but please understand. I'm not that worried, because that's five bucks American. <laughs> come up with as many examples as possible of the world's worst person to be president of the United States. From now on, everyone in North Dakota is named Tim. <laughs> Excuse me, while I drink the water, my vice president will finish my speech. You know, show over and I can't do it. It's Columbus Day, and we're selling off all the states, starting with Alaska. What is your best bid? We've gone crazy! Hi, Carl. 
Hi, Greg. How are you? Good. How are you? <laughs> Colin, I like you as a friend. Is there something you'd like to tell me? Yeah, it, it, Colin. Well, woo, woo. Have you met my Jewish mother? Hi. <laughs> I'm going to lock the door and not let anyone else in. Is that okay? <laughs> I can put on some music. <laughs> Ryan? Ryan, have you met my friend? He's a kleptomaniac. He's, a, he's pilfering. He wants at something very badly. He is... He is the most fun at a party of anyone I've ever invited. He's trying to steal something. He's, he wants my pocket. What does he like to do? He, well, jeez. I know what he's making me want to do. Uh, he, he, he likes to uh, put his hands in my pocket. Yeah. I didn't know that's what you meant when you said you had to take a big pee. Hey, don't cry. You're not that good an actor. You know. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Hey. Yeah. Nice to... Hi. Are you, are you okay? <laughs> All right. Okay. I... Number two. Yeah. I like to keep in shape, and I like to run around in the park. What do you, what do, you do to, to keep in shape? Same thing. Throw me the ball. Throw the ball. Throw the ball. Come up with as many examples of the world's worst dating service video. Just use your imagination. <laughs> Come on, I'm horny. Hi, Colin. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Close enough? Colin, can I get you a drink? Ah! Hello. Hey, Greg, it's okay. Hello, Ryan. Hey, Greg. Colin, you, uh, Ryan, have you met Colin? He's a he's a trapeze artist. He's a high wire act in the circus. He's uh, he thinks he's in the circus. He's a very unsuccessful. <laughs> if I were a damsel in distress, how would you rescue me? <laughs> I'd have to think about it first. Uh... <laughs> Hopefully, if your face was on fire, I'd beat it out. <laughs> uh, Woo me! Uh, all right, here, just once. Woo! 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 Vice President Al Gore was at a fundraiser today where he walked around in women's lingerie for charity purposes. People say he looked good in a pink slip. Look how, look how, I'm talking. Look how fast I'm talking. Look how fast. Look how, look how I'm not talking. Look how fast my mouth is going. I can go. Look, 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 look how fast it's going. My mouth is going really fast. Well, isn't that refreshing? I feel like the meat in an incompetent sandwich. And. And speaking of weather, let's find out from Al Nino what the weekend has in store. It looks like the 
Weekend weather report is just going to be a gleam in someone's eye. That's all the time we have for the 6.30 News. Stay tuned tonight at 11. Thank you. Good night. You're fired. Uh, if we were going to go out on a date, where might you take me to eat? Well, yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> take you to eat. <laughs> well, I'd probably take you to a restaurant. Because that's where the food is. If you were a carpenter, would you rather use a drill or a hammer? I love you. <laughs> You're great. You're just... ...asshole <laughs> of the world's worst dating service video. And that's just my hat. And you don't need to worry, I'm a Trojan. <laughs> you said that so nicely. <laughs> you know, if you're an X-Files fan, you're into conspiracies and hidden secrets, and sometimes those secrets just have to come out. Sometimes there's something unspoken between two people, maybe more on the side of one person than the other, but I've got to tell you something, Greg. Ever since I saw you in WPPL out there in Omaha, Saying the news, my heart just broke. My God, you're beautiful. Kiss me. Kiss me like you've never kissed an anchor before. Uh, have? Tune in. Tune in. Tune in tomorrow for Love Muffins, our morning program. I'll be there with Colin to explain everything. Good night, everyone. Hi. Well, it seems all the fish in the rivers are dying. Could this be an act of cod? <laughs> Some people think it's because of the heavy rains lately. It was raining cats and dogs. I stepped into a poodle. <laughs> it's like puddle, but spelt differently. Tonight on the 6 o'clock news, I guess we won't find out about that weekend weather, will we? Uh, <laughs> I guess not. All right, tune in later for the local news at 10. Thank you so much. Colin. Look out! <laughs> Colin! <laughs> Come on in. All right. Try the dip. Great. Try the Cheetos. <laughs> All the dances of the 20th century. Uh, okay. Look out! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Tarzan! No. Be careful! No, not even close. You're not the guy from the ABC Sports <laughs> Agony Defeat thing, are you? That's close enough. He's a spear who keeps uh, running in the call. The scene to rap. Uh, in this game, Brad and Wayne are going to make up a scene together, and they'll be joined later by Colin and Ryan. However, they're going to be rapping. <laughs> <laughs> And they'll be accompanied by Mixmaster Laura Hall, funky Laura Hall there. And uh, now what I need from the audience is an everyday place where people might meet. A park. A park. Hmm? park is fine, that's fine. Hey there, buddy. Hey there, slugger. Put up your hands, I'm a friendly mugger. Give me your money, give me your dog. Cut down the tree, then give me a log. Give me the bushes and give me the trees. Give me the dogs with all the fleas. Give me the sky, give me that thing. Woo, I'm crazy. Woo! <laughs> Monica Lewinsky, where would you take me? <laughs> home. Well, uh, home anyway. Uh, uh, hello. I'm a Lewinsky here. Oh, I'm going to have a kid you. God, you sound sexy. Oh, yay! Oh! Number two had no jaw. No, he was a guy in a dentist chair. That's a pretty good one, tourists. So, Laura, why don't you start the tourist or kids in a movie theater hoedown? The other day 
that was in a movie. The kids were all loud. They were making noise and throwing stuff. What an ugly crowd. I told them there's something, and then they all cried. I ruined the movie, told them Bambi's mother died. <laughs> a really romantic place, where would that place be? <laughs> and what, what would we... And what... What do you think of romance at a time like this? <laughs> this is your fault, you son of a... <laughs> On this, has she mentioned that he is the father of those children? That's Has a she lie. Been sleeping with you don't know anything about it. Sit years. down. You want yeah, a piece? I want a piece of you. Come, Come on, on up here. I can see the head, Mrs. Johnson. 